Weapon. You got this. Yeah, what he said. You're coming with us. Can't get surrounded. <laughs> Try harder. So what's Soldier Boy's deal? Is he one of us now? He's got balls, this, uh, uh, what was his name again? Cloud. Cloud Strife. Right. And he isn't a soldier anymore. Still, he's a professional, unlike the rest of us. I'm glad to have him. <laughs> this is a one-time gig. When it's done, we're done. Uh, 
Uh, uh. Real joy to work with. Real joy to look at, too. You'll keep us safe, go. right, Cloud? Looks are what people notice first. Guess I'm not on the same page as people. I'd say you're not even reading the same book. Enough. We're done here. Or even the same... Give it a rest. Wow. They've almost got the door. <sighs> Come on. Nobody do something this crazy just for money. They may not think you're a true believer, but you know what I think? Not interested. What? Wedge. Uh, <sighs> you better be worth the money, Merc. Every last gill. Boy. No holding back. Guess you're first. Hey! Looks like you're next. All right. Let's go. Not so fast. We've got company. Should be easy.
was never in doubt. Soldiers may attack on command, but I hear they make good guard dogs, too. Bet you've seen a few reactors. So how do we get to the bridge above Mako storage? <clears throat> Ain't holding out on me, are you? Stamp scared to bite the hand that fed him? Or is he a loyal little doggy? <clears throat> Have it your way, mutt. We can do this with you, or we can do this without you. Different reactor, different layout. Depends when it was built. Never seen one like this, but I'll manage. I'm watching you. I'm watching you. Don't you worry. Biggs will have the door open soon. Don't you worry. Biggs will have the door open soon. In three, two... Damn, I'm good. Who's there? Door! Oh, wait! It's over! That's my line. He's alone! We can take him! Make it rain! I got this place covered. Simmer down, hotshot. It's a good thing I know someone who can get us the passcodes. <sighs> Pity no one else at command will talk to us, but what can you do? <sighs> and we're good. Careful in there. <clears throat> well, what are you waiting for? Security's only gonna get tighter, so be ready. We can't afford any more mistakes. Looks like the elevator's on another floor. Mind pushing that button? <laughs> so, you know Tifa, right? It's not really my business, but are you guys close? Tifa and I...
These sewer rats appear to call themselves Avalanche, sir. We are currently investigating whether they belong to the same group that made the attempt on your life. Rest assured, our inquiries will not take much longer. <laughs> this pump's sole purpose is to drain the planet dry. While you sleep, while you eat, while you shit, it's here sucking up Marco. It doesn't rest, and it doesn't care. You do realize what Marco is, don't you? Marco <clears throat> is the lifeblood of our world. The planet bleeds green like you and me bleed red. The hell you think's gonna happen when it's all gone, huh? Answer me! You gonna stand there and pretend you can't hear the planet crying out in pain? I know you can! You really hear that? Damn straight I do! Get help. <laughs> Say that again! I'd worry less about the planet and more about the next five seconds. Save the screaming for later. Our lives are on the line now. You listening, Merc? One false move. And that happens. Well, so much for having Cloud do all the fighting. There are some places a sword just can't reach. <laughs> just bear with him for me, would you? <sighs> yeah. Should have asked for more money. We have here the laser security system great those things will hurt more than your pride if you're careless they'll cut you down to size and then some but i'm guessing you've done this kind of thing before yeah figure out the timing of the lasers then make a move when they cycle off exactly i'll go first nothing like a little danger to get the blood pumping hey just keep those baby blues of yours on me Not too shabby. 
Those things sweepers for nothing. They can wipe out a whole squad in seconds. Not if you wipe the floor with them first. Ha! Ah, we can take this hunk of junk! That hunk of junk is a heavy weapons platform. If we rush in, we die. Is that right? We need to hit it with magic. That should give us an opening. down again. No time to complain. <laughs> no holding back. No escape. <laughs> Now's our chance. Go! Don't need to tell me twice. I'm gonna enjoy this! Brace yourself. What are you? One soldier. First. Huh? Soldier of first class. Doesn't go into the twenties. The hell are you talking about? I mean your age, not your goddamn rank. I... Uh... Though for all I know, a soldier's rank could be the same as his age. Mm -hmm. Guess that make you a one-year-old, huh? Live and learn! That's our target, the reactor core. Gotta set the bomb at the bottom. Let's get down there. God damn. I can practically taste it. <laughs> Hurry it up!
Not that way. Down the ladder, dummy. Let's see if Little Stamp really can bite the hand that feeds. Hmm. Go on. Do the honors. Prove to me you're the man Tifa says you are. That you're one of us. Never said I was. I'm just here for the paycheck. Then do the damn job! Fine. What about the timer? Your call, Merc. Pretty cocky, ain't you? Your brilliant plan, genius. 
<laughs> it's my time to shine. <laughs> or go down in flames. Bingo! Focus on that core! Oh, now he remembers! Don't keep me waiting in suspense next time! Deal with that. About damn time! This is gonna sting! Huh? It didn't work! If we don't change it up soon, this thing's gonna kill us both! Less talking, more shooting! How about less miss from you? Damn it! Now, hit it hard and fast. Oh, you in for it now? Just shoot. Gotta heal up. Take me. Need my help, do you? Auto 
repair unit. Damn it. We gotta take it out quick or we're screwed. <laughs> oh, I am way ahead of you, Bert. When I get my chance, I'm gonna blow this bastard the hell up! And that's a promise! You hear that? Damn thing showed you how it's done. Come on, we've got to move. Where should we be covering our way out? Go, go, go! Hang back. Whoa. 
on you. I got this. No escape. Now. Try this. You're done. Keep it up. Let's kick it up and Here comes. Bring the heat. Give him what's coming. Leave it to me.
you'd be the first to know. I'll take that as a yes. Okay, that was pretty cool. <laughs> All right, come on. Looks like we made it. And with nothing but a few scratches to show. <laughs> Think you might have overdone it? I followed the instructions to the letter. Maybe it triggered a reaction with the Mako? Well, let's hope the city's still in one piece. But the planet's what matters, right? <laughs> I mean, this must have helped some. After all that, it had better have. Anyway, let's get going. We in Sector 8? That'd be just down there. All right, then. Lead the way. You got it. Huh. Watch out for live wires. They're everywhere. Ugh. The air in here reeks. Can't wait to get out in the open. Man, what is that? I've never smelled anything so foul. Oh, it's me. Gotta do something about that. And soon. I felt that one in my guts. They just keep on coming. We need to get out of this place. Was it the Mako density? The primary explosive? The blasting agent? Hey, we can figure that out later. <sighs> I'm running on empty here. You can refuel at the base. Next time I'll have to bring a little pick-me-up. How much farther do we have to go? Not far. That's about as good a place as any. Stand back then. I'll set the bomb. Can't wait to see you, Marlene. Can't wait to take a hot shower. She's good to go. Sure told those doors. Let that be a Let's lesson to anything that gets in my way. Attention all citizens. Attention all citizens. This is an alert from the Shinra Emergency Operations Center. Unidentified intruders have detonated a bomb inside Mako Reactor 1. Multiple explosions have been confirmed, as well as ongoing fires. In response, a disaster warning has been issued in sectors 1 and 8. Structures in the area are at high risk of collapse, rendering the entire sector hazardous. Therefore, all residents of No. No way. This couldn't have been us, could it? But what if it was? What's done is done. <sighs> Merck's right. It ain't pretty, but we can't stop now. This was just the first reactor, and the planet won't be safe till we get the rest. Yeah, we always knew this was gonna get messy. And this is only the beginning. Y'all gotta look at the bigger picture here. 
Nothing worth fighting for was ever won without sacrifice. Though you may not be crying out, I know you're in pain, just like the planet. But it's okay, cause I'm here for you, to help take the load off your shoulders. Your fears, your worries, your concerns, and yes, your fears. Whatever your problem, I got you. Huh? Hmm. So, what's our next move, boss? That's easy enough. We get our asses home! Hmm. Hmm. Split up and shoot for the last train home. Regroup in the freight car. Got it? Later then! Hey. I'd like my money now. You can have it once we're back at base. Tell you what this is, right? Of course not. It's healing material. You can have it for saving my life. Just doing my job, nothing more. Yeah, yeah. Fact is, I'm lucky you were there. <clears throat> Survival can be a matter of luck or skill, and you can't rely on luck. Words to live by. Uh, yeah, well, thanks. You do know how to use it, right? You do know what I was, right?
goddamn rubble. Station's right over there. Then... Not real. You're dead. I am. Um... I killed you with my own. <gasps> oh, you need not remind me. It was the crowning moment of our time together. But that was then, and this is now. I have a favor to ask. Our beloved planet is dying. Slowly. Silently. Painfully. Can you bear to see the planet suffer? Cloud. Were the planet to die, so many things will be lost. Your hometown, the moon so bright, the sound of her voice, pleading for me to spare you, the shiver of her flesh, Yielding to cold steel. That which binds us together would be no more, and I would be loath to live in such a world, which is why I must ask you this one favor. 
don't worry, it's a simple thing. Run, Cloud. Run away. You have to leave. You have to live. You bastard! Good, Cloud. Very good. Hold on to that hatred. I'm seeing things. Fumes from all the Mako, maybe. All right. You got this. really worth breaking our necks over? Yes, because we won't. This is an alert Get me out of here, please! An evacuation order has been issued to the occupants of buildings in the vicinity of the Sector 8 Expressway. You are advised to vacate the area immediately. The explosions at the reactor have caused numerous ongoing fires. Many homes are at risk. It is not safe to remain indoors. Please leave your residences at once. I repeat, this is an alert from the Shinra Emergency Operations Center. An evacuation order has been issued to the occupants of buildings in the vicinity of the Sector 8 Expressway. You are advised to vacate the area immediately. Man, what a mess. Explosions at the reactor have caused numerous ongoing fires. Many homes are at risk. It is not safe to remain what indoors. Please leave fires? your residences at once. Oh, what, what if they reach us? What do we do then? <laughs> this is an alert from the Shinra Emergency Operations Center. There. An evacuation order. Are advised to vacate the area immediately. The explosions oh, at the reactor have caused us. numerous ongoing oh, fires. Many yeah, homes are at risk. It is not safe to remain indoors. Please leave your residences at once. Sure hope the Mako does catch. Do what you like. This I'm taking the kids to safety. No, we stay together. Yeah, together. I don't want to leave without you. Me too. I'm staying. You are Don't let the intruder escape. Security's everywhere. The fire won't spread this far, will it? save anyone, not even yourself. Are you okay? 
Hey, are you okay? I'm fine. Here, this is for you. Huh? A flower? That's right. It's a gift. You know, for scaring those things away. What things? Never mind. Think of it as a memento. Just my luck. I heard that, you know. How much? Well, that depends on the customer. In your case... <laughs> it's on the house. Huh? Lovers used to give these when they were reunited. Look, I'm involved in things. Dangerous things. Oh, I'm sure you are. So? So keep your distance. Wait, you think someone's out to get you? Is that what you're all worked up about? Relax. No one's going to attack you. I promise. Hey, a Mako reactor just blew. You shouldn't be out here trying to self- <gasps>
not safe to remain indoors. Please leave your residences at once. That bastard couldn't have gotten far! Stay alert! I don't want to stick around here. An evacuation order has been issued to the occupants of buildings in the vicinity of the Sector 8 Expressway. Our advice to vacate the area immediately.
Open fire! Shoot to kill! Close call. Be advised! Target approaching residential area! Steal all access immediately! Target sighted! Get him! It's all or nothing now.
that's that. This cloud won't be joining us after all. No need to assume the worst. I'm sure he's fine. You saw him in action, didn't you? Guy's a soldier. Goddamn one-man army. Mm -hmm. Hmm. You think he's a keeper? To, huh? <laughs> Giving public security the runaround? That's what. Had to draw them away from the station somehow. Nicely done. Well, can't argue with results, huh? <clears throat> what? <sighs> hmm. Wait. Got a question for you all. What? Ever been attacked by an invisible enemy? Uh, what? Wearing robes. Came and went like the wind. <laughs> Thought they were invisible. They were, at first. Only saw them after she grabbed me. A new Shinra weapon, maybe? <laughs> More like a panic-induced hallucination. <clears throat> Never mind. Forget I said anything. Suit yourself. Come on, let's move up. A lot of people here. And in the freight car, too. Because of the evacuation order, maybe? Lucky this us. We've got a crowd to hide here. Head for the front of the train to hold there. An emergency schedule is now in effect. Your understanding and cooperation is appreciated. Right for shitting on the slums. Just wanted to be a Sector A, that's normal. Are you the one who's so bad? Man, oh, man. everyone's on edge. Of course they are. Hey, Cloud. I, um. If you're about to unburden yourself, don't. Yeesh. You don't make it easy. Stop that right now! Hey, got a sec? Should have never gotten out of bed this morning. Just called in sick. 
Just leave me alone, all right? You're, uh, holding up pretty well, huh? Even after what we saw at the station and all over Sector 8? I'm a soldier. Well, Why don't you learn to take a hit, buddy? My hands are still buddy. shaking. You get used to it. Something to look forward to. Or maybe not. You see, my daughter now Why lives in Sector 8, hit, so... Buddy? Do you think Wu Tai's to blame? Little help, Cloud? Please? I can't Don't stop thinking stupid. about it. The bomb yeah, I made shouldn't have produced an explosion that big. Now. It doesn't make any sense. The explosion triggered a reaction with the Mako. You said so yourself. That was but my first guess, but shouldn't the reactor have fail-safes sure to prevent that kind of thing? Too. <laughs> no, sure you mentioned invisible happen. enemies back there, right? Right. <sighs> no. I'm just looking for excuses for something that was clearly my own fault. <sighs> Gotta own up to it if I'm gonna learn from this and move on. Thanks, Cloud. You're a good listener. What kind of maniacs would go so far as to bomb a reactor? <sighs> They've yet to announce it publicly, but I heard it was Avalanche's doing. Really? Aren't they the terrorists who tried to kill the president? Is there nothing they won't do? Hey, <gasps> quit talking <gasps> out your ass. <sighs> Everyone knows Avalanche only cares about saving the planet. Hmm? Ch just who do you think you are? A law-abiding concerned citizen. Law-abiding? Really? <laughs> uh, uh, shh. Don't mm -hmm. antagonize him. In my humble opinion, that explosion was a message. A message to the bastards bleeding our planet dry. Think they got it? Heard it loud and clear, y'all's masters. We will not submit to intimidation or violence, but work together for peace and prosperity. That is how civilized people change the world. That's right. That is the Shinra Creed. Them's <laughs> fighting words. It's what we believe. We all have to follow our conscience, don't we? We should go. Right. <laughs> oh, dear. I didn't hear anything. You gotta believe me. You hear that suit? Shinra Creed, my ass. We're the good guys, damn it. You hear that suit? Shinra Creed, my ass. Man, this train is slower than molasses, am I right? They'd probably kill us if they knew we were the ones responsible. Well, I get it if you can't relate. Uh, shower might help. A long, hot one. Calm down, it's just a side. Get this out of the way. Personally, I find visual aids make the dull stuff a lot more bearable. If it helps, think of it as an initiation rite. How many times do I have to tell you people? I'm not... There's such a thing as playing too hard to get. So, here we've got a wireframe model of the great city of Midgar, complete with massive steel plates suspended 300 meters above ground level. Atop which stands a shining beacon of civilization. The whole system is sustained by the Mako reactors, which feed the insatiable appetites of the public. The train will be passing through an ID oh. checkpoint shortly. This here is the train's route. As you can see, it'll take us around this main pillar. Look, we're about halfway through it now. They've set up a checkpoint here to scan the IDs of all passengers heading in and out. Date of birth, residential status, criminal history, all that and more is automatically cross-referenced in their databases. 
Public security wouldn't have it any other way. Heads up. Don't worry. Our IDs are impeccable. What'd I tell ya? Have a little faith. Won't be long till we reach the bottom. Relax. Take a good look. It's because of that great big pizza in the sky that people down there gotta struggle to survive. Shinra sucks up Mako while the soil turns to dust, the air fills with smog, and the flowers die. Then leave and don't look back. <sighs> that's what's always worked for me. <sighs> well, that's all well and good. If you only out for yourself. But the folks down there don't have the luxury of choice, you know. One, members lost zero. And one step closer to a brighter future. Hell yeah! Guys! Lower your voices, huh? People are listening. Oh, God. Right. <laughs> ah. hm. Now get some r, &R. You've earned it. Just be ready for the next mission, all right? Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> See you soon. Uh, at Seventh Heaven. You know, where Tifa works. Don't keep her waiting, she'll worry. Not long now, buddy. <laughs> so, what do we have about the baby girl and the reactor? Are you sure you haven't seen my husband? Uh, if I did, I don't remember. Office still there? Somehow. As long as the trains are running, it'll be work as usual tomorrow. He's really tall. You'd have no trouble spotting him, even if he was in a crowd. Sorry, doesn't ring any bells. How are people here? You see them huge? Wow, am I hungry? Guess I'll stop by one. You see the huge explosion on TV? Huh? Yeah, yeah, I saw it. No way! I'd kill for one right now. What are we even doing here? No one in their right mind would go into a train graveyard at night. People talk, rumors spread, and kids get curious. You know how it is. Speaking of which, you hear it was supposedly a ghost, not a monster, that attacked that guy this afternoon? They must have been seeing things. Talk about weird stuff going down. A reactor bombing, train graveyard being closed off. What? In the graveyards? Come on out, ghosts! I'm going on a ghost hunt. Come on out, ghosts! Never been so Office still there? Oh. Somehow. Let's go someplace into this crowd. Train services have concluded for the day. Hey, leftovers are for kids only, dummy. When I put him in charge of my stand, I told him, son, the goal isn't to make a fortune. It's to make people happy. If someone's having a bad day, it's your job to put a smile on their face. Well, by the looks of things, I'd say he took that lesson to heart. 
much is enough fried march? A handful or hear me out. No words can describe what kind of right the Apparently Shinra thinks it's a group called Avalanche. That's what I heard on the train anyway. Avalanche. That sounds familiar. Huh? What kind of person bombs a reactor? The kind of person who goes around putting up flyers all over the slums, I expect. I've never felt the ground shake like that. Look, mm -hmm. apparently Shinra thinks it. Don't play his own. Uh, I've never seen anything like it before. Uh, it was like a giant uh, center cave was a nightmare. Fires everywhere. Huh. Mako is the lifeblood of the planet? Yeah, the hell it is. Goddamn eco warriors with their dumbass posters. I tear them down and they're back up inside of an hour. Like I've got nothing better to do. I mean, look at all that steelwork. You trying to tell me that's not progress? <laughs> 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 What the? You okay, buddy? <sighs> Mako Junkie, huh? Figures. You again. shower can't come soon enough. I can barely tell my skin from all the ash and sweat. When I get back, it's refueling time. And you, Jesse? I don't know. Figure out how I screwed up? <laughs> You're such a kidder. That's where I work. No freaking way. Put that fire out, idiots! I was there yesterday. Thanks. Marlene. <laughs> Daddy, you're home. That's right, Angel. I am. Back. <laughs> Have you been a good girl? Yeah, I've been helping <laughs> Tifa. Oh, you did, did you? Well, well. <laughs> you made it. Where'd you get that? I can't remember the last time I saw a real one. Sweet. When did you get so thoughtful? A guy can change. It has been five years. Huh? I need to talk to Barrett. Right. Come on in. Daddy, the Mako place blew up. Everyone on TV is talking about it. Don't you worry about all that silliness. Daddy's here and he's not going anywhere tonight. Now turn that thing off and let's get you to bed, huh? Uh. Hey! Uh, what the hell do you think you're doing scaring my daughter like that? Daddy says never talk to strangers. <laughs> That's right, honey, I do say that. What a good girl you are remembering Daddy's lessons. <laughs> You know what else good girls do? They go to bed on time. Come on. But I'm not tired. I want to talk some more, Daddy. Mm, all right, but just this once. <sighs> uh, so then, what can I get you? My money. I'm still waiting on it. Uh, right. 
About that. We should talk outside. <sighs> um, Daddy? Did the people who died all return to the planet? Of course. Let that be a lesson to you. Before we get on to money, there's an empty apartment in a place just down the road. It's nothing fancy, but I was thinking you could stay there for now. The landlady's a big friend of the cause, so you wouldn't even have to pay rent. Sound good? Sure does. Thanks. <laughs> Follow me then. How was it up on the plate? It was chaotic. Sorry for dragging you into all this. It was, it was wrong of me to put you in I danger like that. that. I promise I won't do it again. Dangerous part of the job. Don't worry about me. <laughs> I'll try not to. Always happy to help stick it to Shinra. Not good at all. So, you make nice with everyone? As much as I could, all things considered. Maybe not enough for them. Good. You had me worried. You're not exactly a people person. I'll give you that. I saw Sector 8 on the news. It was like a war zone. The news is just another Shinra mouthpiece. They'll spread whatever lies Shinra tells them to. Think so, Sector 7? it wasn't the that bad? This on it themselves. was. Oh, right. And here we are, good old Stargazer Heights. You're on the second floor. Room 201 here is where I sleep. Don't have time for much else, what with Seventh Heaven and all. <laughs> Not even time to decorate. Here's your room, 202. Don't worry, I already told the landlady about you. You did? Yes? Oh, I mean I told her I had a friend looking for a place to stay. Was that too much? No. It's fine. And this? That one's, uh... Know what? It's getting late. I'll introduce you tomorrow. It's a little bare. But should be enough to get you through the night. If you want anything else, we can always there get it. There is one thing. My money. You guys owe me 2,000, remember? I do. And we'd love to settle up, especially since this was your first job for us, but... That's it? Sorry. We spent the rest preparing for the mission. That really is it. But not for long. I'm collecting money for filters tomorrow, so I can pay you after. <sighs> And you're sure about that? Of course, as long as you help, that is. Wait, then I'd have to pay you for that, too. Never mind. No, two thousand's enough. That's what we agreed on, so that'll be the price. With what you gave me, that leaves fifteen hundred. You're the best. I'll see you bright and early at the bar, then. Thanks again for everything. Sleep tight. <sighs> Guess it's time for introductions. 
Okay in there? Oh. Coming in. But he's not a bad guy. The landlady asked me to check on him now and then to make sure he's okay. Can I ask you to do the same? Sure. Well now, you must be Cloud. I'm Marl, your landlady. So how'd you like the place? You from up on high? I've been around. I'll bet. No matter. All kinds come through with all kinds of reasons. If you ever need an ear to bend, I'll lend you mine. Can be about anything. Even Tifa. What's she to you? The granddaughter I never had. And if you hurt her, I'll take it out of your hide. You hear me? Loud and clear. Good. Now you'd best get a move on to Seventh Heaven. She's got a head start on you and then some. Come on, quit lollygagging and go to Seventh Heaven already. To report. Maintaining surveillance. My husband decided to go to the state. <sighs> hmm. Looking good. Quality product makes a huge difference. Just like that.
looking good. Quality product makes a huge difference. Chili beans! Get your chili beans! A Sector 7 favorite! How about it? Y'all won't find better beans this side of the plate! Oh, how's about you and me get a room? Give or take it. There are so many people that just don't get that the planet is a living thing. Shit was brainwashed. Morning. Hey. Just so you know, Marlene's still asleep. <sighs> Let's get down to business, shall we? Huh? These water filters won't replace themselves. <laughs> Although the next batch probably could, if Jessie put her mind to it. Most every home in the area has one. Folks love them because they practically eliminate the rotten egg smell. Honestly, they make us more money than this place. And it's easy money, too. We bring new filters, collect the old ones, and get paid. What? <sighs> Give me a break. I'm not a salesman. I'm a soldier. Which is why no one will refuse to pay. What do you say? <sighs> Please? <sighs> Let's get this over with. Great. And while we're at it, I'll give you the grand tour. Go ahead and keep whatever we collect. Seeing as you didn't bring any luggage, I'm guessing there's stuff you need to buy. Thanks. And don't worry. We'll pay you the difference Everyone's after. Barrett's out making his rounds too. Don't take your eyes off. As long as I get it all done. Take your time now. Okay. Some creepy dude hit on you. All the items you could want straight from the plate. No matter your needs or your budget. All hey there. Here to change out your water filter. Tifa, baby, how you doing? It's been waiting for you to. Wait, let me see. Cloud's in charge of collections. He'll take your money. Sounds like a pretty sweet gig. If you ever need someone to fill in, I'm your man. In your dreams, maybe. Huh? Cloud! Uh, since we're here, maybe we should do a little shopping. Suppose I could take a look? If you're ever in the market for anything else, drop on by. Especially if Teeth is with you. We'll see you around, okay? And let us know when your filter next needs changing. All the items you can want are straight from the plate. No matter your needs or your budget, our wide selection of items. He's a regular. Stock up here and he might throw in a freebie or two. For you, maybe. Well, you could try being a little nicer. To get free shit? Not my style. <laughs> Our next stop is Stargazer Heights. Landlady's a client. Just met her. Then you know what to expect. Remember, she's a good friend of Avalanche, so be nice. Please? Imagine if rich people start thinking it's safer down here. Apparently it was done by a terrorist group called Apple. Nothing to report. Maintaining surveillance. Hey, Marl. Got some filters for you. Tifa, my dear, dear girl. Oh, what's he doing here? Working? Be nice. <laughs> Cloud's helping me with collections. You'd better take care of her. I'm pretty good at taking care of myself, you know. That I do. 
Still, better him than you. No charm, no wit, big sword, but no skills. I've got skills. Be nice. I'm doing my best. You're looking awfully glum. Are you getting enough sleep? A good long rest will cure anything, I tell you. A tried and true lesson for life on the ground floor, am I right? That you are. Now, your money. Thanks, Marl. You take care of yourself. Don't do anything I wouldn't do. Marl's great. She helped get me set up back in the day. You been here a while now? Five years, game. give or take. How? Ain't they short handed? Uh, but Absolutely. never mind that. But We've got to get you your money. Last hard. stop is the weapons drawer. Don't try anything funny or you'll hey, get it. it. The kids seem to think you're pretty cool. Hmm? Hey! That last filter didn't do shit! We're so sorry about that. Hopefully this one will work better. Save your excuses and get out! All right. If you could just settle your bill, we'll be on our way. The hell? You charging me for your busted ass goods? My associate handles payment disputes. Think you can mosey up in here and have it your way? Pretty please. <clears throat> Thank you very much. Seeing as we're done with our rounds and you've got a small fortune now, why not take a gander at the weapons? Well, when will Barrett be back with the rest? <sighs> Before we open up tonight. It'll be a while yet, so... What do you want to do? Don't really know. In that case, I've got a suggestion. Want to hear it? If you're serious about becoming a merc, then you're going to need to start making connections. It's not what you know, but who you know, you know? Hmm. Another lesson for life on the ground floor? Yep. Connections get you jobs. Jobs build your rep. And more rep gets you better connections. How do I start? Hmm. Why not help out the Neighborhood Watch? They're mostly volunteers, but you'll get to know people. Yeah, okay. Didn't see anybody at the office, so let's head up top. No better way to keep you and your family safe than with a weapon of your own. Come and check out our selection. We gotta do something about the monsters on Scrap Boulevard. I'll head on down there first thing tomorrow. Huh. Didn't know you were holding down the fort. Huh? Oh, uh, hey, Cloud. Looking to join the neighborhood watch? That depends. What does this neighborhood watch do? Uh... Lots of stuff, really. But our top priority is taking care of any beasts that wander into town. That, and teaching the locals how to defend themselves. Like they say, the only one who will look out for you is you. Cloud's a great fighter, but only we know that. If no one knows him, no one will hire him. Thought if he joined the watch, he could get his name out there. That would work for everybody. Truth be told, we could really use your help. We can't pay you in kill, but we'll work something out. For example... Aha! What about your sword? I could mod it for you. No thanks. It's fine just the way it is. What? You some kind of purist? I know I'd never pass up a chance to improve my gear. Come on. At least let me show you how it's done.
all set? Needless to say, you'll have to try it out to appreciate the difference. Thanks. <laughs> we'll do you one better. Spread the word to everyone who'll listen about the new Mercantown. Between him and Wedge, there isn't anyone they don't know. I'll march through the streets singing your praises, even on an empty stomach. So, where are these monsters? Scrap Boulevard. Good hunting. Hey, Cloud, I'll come with. No, I've got this. But you don't know the way, do you? We don't. <laughs> sure thing. I know these streets better than anyone. supposed to keep the monsters out. Starting anyway, we should prepare, just in case. Searching for candidates. Is that who Wedge mentioned? The merchant? Is that who Wedge mentioned? That sword's massive. What does he sell again? Good luck, Tifa, and be careful! Here's Scrap Boulevard. I can see why monsters would feel right at home. And the more we pile up, the more they show up. Show me what you got, Cloud. Oh, so that's what a soldier looks like in action. This was just a warm-up. <laughs> I'll bet. Let's keep at it. Come on. That's that. 
You're good at this. Charging in like it was nothing. You too. It's a little surprising. Well, I've been here five years now. If you don't look out for yourself, no one else will. By the way, that one's gonna be on the test. This a lesson? Gotta learn if you're gonna stick around. Okay, let's wrap this up. I think that might be the last of them. You won't stay gone for long. Of course not. Even so, folks will be grateful for the peace and quiet in the meantime. A win's a win, you know? True. Trust me, it'll do wonders for your rep. Right. Let's go check in with Biggs and Wedge. Searching for Merchant? candidates. Searching for candidates. You, you just opened up shop in the area, didn't you? Get off. The tally of Monster Slain has been updated. Got new numbers for Monster Slain this month. Check them out. Hey, you just opened up shop in the area, didn't you? Doesn't look that strong. Huh? I ain't got nothing for a punk ass bitch like you. Get on out of here. Um. Over there has got a real hard on for planes. Shoot this one out once you more. He was really hey, you just opened up shop in here. That's that person. I wonder if there's any way they can make our guns. No better way to keep you and your family safe. You hear someone got rid of them. Back already? Got every last one too. Now the slum should be safe. You guys are machines! Good job. Meanwhile, we told everyone we could about you. So I heard. I've got to ask, though. What did you tell them? It's all right. All you got to do is keep up the good work. It'll pay off soon enough, I promise. How's the sword, by the way? Good. Glad to hear it. Seems like the perfect fit for you. Yeah. We've been through a lot. <laughs> You okay? I'm fine. Been meaning to ask. After you left the village... It's a long story. I've got time. Why don't you tell me all about it while we try to wrestle up some more work for you? That sounds great! I'll come too! Oh, uh, no you won't. What? Run along now, you two. Uh, Sorry, Go on. maybe uh. next time. Huh? No fair! Uh, think about it for a second. They haven't seen each other in years. You'd be a third wheel. <sighs> hey, before we get back to it, why don't you check out the weapons? No need. Come on, the dealer's probably heard all about you by now. Might treat you better. I don't know about that. You hear someone got rid of all the monsters on Strap Boulevard? No. No better way to keep you and your family safe? Hold up. Come and check Heard there's a merc that'll take on any monster. You the man? Word spreads fast around here. What if I am? 
Sorry about before. I get antsy when business is slow. Ugh. That man in your line of work needs weapons, no? Why not try that one on for size? Yours on the house. Badass like you rocking my weapons is good advertising. Think about it. Fine. Or if you want to take a look at something else. Just a look. Don't be a stranger. Since you've got yourself a new weapon, let's see if we can't put it to good use. Come on, let's go chat up Weimer. Who? The guy who tracks all the requests that come to the watch. You never know, could toss some work your way. Where's he at? Oh, he should be back at the office by now. Searching for candidates. Oh, hey there, Tifa. You need a helping hand? Actually, I wanted to introduce you to an old friend of mine. This is Cloud. He's a merc. Ah, uh, you don't say. Well, we're always on the lookout for experienced fighters to help us deal with the bigger critters. I'll take on anything. For the right price, that is. Experienced and cocky, huh? If it's a challenge you want, I might have a few good ones. Your clients can fill you in on the details. Prove yourself at these jobs, and I'll see if I can't find you some more. Thanks. Candidate detected. Performing physical analysis. Sizable weapon. Excellent cardiovascular health and impressive lung capacity. Perfectly balanced muscle and bone structure. An optimal candidate! My name is Chadley. I'm an intern for Shinra's Research and Development Division. I hope you'll be interested in helping me with my research. Please accept this as a down payment. I would like you to set that assessed materia in your equipment and use it to gather intelligence in battle. This data will help me to develop new types of materia. I'm not interested in working for Shinra. You should know that I work actively to undermine Shinra's efforts. I'm sure you of all people can appreciate the tremendous power of materia as well as how it might be wielded against your corporate enemies. And if you later decide that I am not worthy of your trust, you can do what you do best. I will hold you to that. Excellent! Then we shall work together so long as you deem fit. 
Once you've completed your task, please return and report to me. Please set the orb of assess materia to your equipment and use it to gather battle. You'll never want for work around here if you prove yourself useful. Hmm? I hear you so slow. she can help me find my friends. I know someone who can help you. This guy right here. Really? Okay, let me tell you all about them. They have long arms and legs, and they're a little skinny. They like places where there's food. And nice people will give them treats when they ask. And small spaces. Oh yeah, and they're all cats. <sighs> I'm looking for cats? They're friendly, so if you call them, they'll come running. All three of them. Find my friends, please. They love crowded places, like the road to the station. A lot of people stop to play with them there. What's the source of all life? The life stream, right? <laughs> And goods when I get sick. Think we could get some Wait. Uh, we'll Did you hear that just box. now? Yeah, I think one of Betty's cats birds. might be nearby. Oh, uh, that was definitely a cat. Oh, I wonder if it's one of Betty's. And drop Wait. your tools. Did you hear Take that just now? now okay? I think one of Betty's cats might be nearby. Ah, that was definitely a cat. I wonder if it's one of Betty's. Johnny's not a bad guy. Yes, you enjoy yourself. I swear I just heard a cat. I've chatted with that Eric guy a few times. Looks like a real hard ass, but it's actually pretty chill. <sighs> get a cat to come out. It snatched one of my pastries and scurried in there. Will you be a deer and lend me a hand? This sucks. Ugh, screw this. What? They ran away? 
So, never gonna see them again? You guys! You came back! They said that a scary man was chasing them. <laughs> Thank you! That went well. Could be you found your calling. Yeah. Was all right, I guess. Think of each job as an opportunity. Not to make money, but to build connections. It's not what you know, but who. <laughs> you remembered. Not a patient teacher. <laughs> Maybe not so patient next time. Oh, boy. <laughs> oh, Barrett should have finished collecting his share of the money by now. So what do you want to do? Head back to the bar? What's a live stream? Next item on the Friends of Freshness agenda? Sorry. So, you're... Virgin Queen up Scrap Boulevard. Nice job, buddy. What an asshole. They're nothing. Worked up a good sweat. This won't take long. you. For a shower. That should be enough intel for the kid. That, uh, what was it? Cloud! You were the first to gather the data I requested. Here is the rest of your payment. I have developed new materia. Would you like to see it? I plan to develop more materia in the future. Together, we can harness enough power to take down Shinra. I'll keep repairing more battle intel reports, which I hope you will assist me in completing. Got 
Gotta admit, I'm watching. I was thinking I might chat up on oh So God. they blew up a reactor thing. My husband decided to go to this. Aha, the man with the strange It's so hot. Hey there, Tifa. Welcome back. And you, the new mercantile looking for work, right? Yeah. In that case, maybe you could do something about the Doom Rats? Them and their were-rat buddies have been tearing up town, looking for food and whatnot. Got into the store and made one hell of a mess, let me tell you. <laughs> oh, you think that's funny, do you? Don't lie. I saw you crack a smile. Well, do the job and you can laugh it up for all I care. Anyway, they're probably nesting in the outskirts. Now I've heard a were-rat in pain will call its friends for help. And the whole rat pack will come running just like that. This might be a waste of time. Let's head back to the store and touch base for now. The leader of the Rat Pack is the worst of them all. The loudest, most obnoxious, squeaking. Johnny liked to mimic it until we told him to cut that shit out. Hey, this looks like a bloodstain to you. Shit, not always there. Hello, hello! Oh, what do we have here? I'm guessing you're that merc I've heard so much about. You're not here to shop, are you? People were right. You look like you can handle yourself. So some drakes have made themselves at home in the abandoned Talliger factory. Can't have that kind of trouble around here. My regulars will do anything to get their hands on the scrap in there, and if they run into those drakes, they could get hurt. I'll handle it. Much obliged, sir. Head on over to the old Talliger factory and talk to Narjan. He's the watchman guarding the entrance. Good luck. I'm counting on you, my friend. Narjan's the one with all the details. Don't forget to stock up before you go. with you. Heard you took out some were rats, which is nice and all, but the job was to wipe off the doom rats. No biggie. Get back out there and finish the job, and we're good. Don't look so glum. It's only a matter of time till they show. You'll get them this time for sure. All the items you can want. Straight oh, yes, sir. Yeah! 
Don't overdo it. Let me handle this. This one's gonna haunt me. You can walk straight from the plane. No matter your needs or your budget, our wide selection of items is guaranteed to satisfy. You're a lover? You a fighter? No worries. We've got anything and everything you could possibly be looking for. Finally managed to get those doom rats, huh? Thanks, guys. You're the greatest. Was so dead in here, I thought I might have to close up shop for good. Hey, got an idea. Hear me out. If the guy who took care of the town's rat problem told everybody where he liked to shop, well, what do you say? I'll make it worth your while, of course. Give you some incentive. Talk you up to Weimer and my customers and anybody else who listen. You'll be swimming in work before you know it. Yeah, sure. <laughs> okay, then. That's what I like to hear. Seventh Heaven, the new Merc in town in my little store. I can see it now. We're gonna clean up. wrong. Let's check it out. Glad we no longer have a rat problem. Looks like I'm not wrong. You never know. <laughs> if the planet's a living... There are monsters on the plate, too, right? Nope. That's uh... not fair. The factory's off-limits. Factory's off-limits. Drakes have been spotted inside. Huh? Wait a minute. Tifa? Don't tell me you're here to take care of those things. Are you? In that case, be my guest. We believe there's at least two groups lurking somewhere inside the factory. Find and cull them all.
This won't take long. You're dead. Those gloves up. Sure thing, coach. You're good at this. <laughs> Told you so. Locked up tight. Damn it. Let's end this quick. That's that. Keep it together. Let me handle this. There. Was never in doubt.
They're nothing. Compared to us, at least. <laughs> Got rid of those drakes in the factory, did ya? What a relief. I can't wait to give my regulars the good news. You're the real deal, all right. Keep it up, and I can see you going far as a merc in this town. I've worked with my fair share over the years, so believe me when I say that I know what I'm talking about. Anyway, you're needed over at the pillar. Apparently another flying bastard stirring up trouble. Bet you can't get enough of this, huh? Well... No, I get it. If you're good at something, might as well make it your living. May not know you, but I know a man who's found his calling when I see one. Keep at it. I switch out my stock every so often, so drop by when you're in the neighborhood, huh? I'll bet a lot of people are talking about you right now. There's this amazing merc who can handle anything. Nothing I've done around here has been all that special, though. Oh, so you want more of a challenge, huh? Welcome! I'm always getting in new stuff to keep up with the latest trends. You won't be disappointed. Always a pleasure. Oh, if you're planning to, might want to buy some extra supplies first. Welcome! Let me know if you need help. Always a pleasure. Oh, if you're planning to, might want to buy some extra supplies first. Got the latest and greatest Those disgusting vermin to the merc who dealt with those, that wasn't me who put in the request. But as a resident of Culvert Street, I appreciate what you did. Not that you or me know anything about that. Stole some blast data from a Shinra warehouse. So public security started asking questions, and you know how Johnny gets. It's because of the reactor bombing, I bet. I could be wrong, but something tells me they're not gonna settle for just roughing him up this time. We've gotta save him, Cloud. Is he Avalanche? No. He doesn't really know what we do. But he has his suspicions. And he's a talker. Actually, you know what? Maybe I should go alone. I'm coming. Uh, are you sure? It's the least I can do. Lead on. <sighs> Thanks. Come on. He needs to get his act together. At it again? Glad we no longer have a rat problem. I'm not the help it. Come 
lot of citizens don't steal blasting agent. So why don't you tell me why your ID popped when we were going over the warehouse logs? Huh? You've got it all wrong. Never thought anywhere near a Shinra warehouse. I swear, all he had to do was keep his mouth shut. Yep. Anyway, you distract the officers and I'll figure something out. Let him go. Hmm? Who are you? The cavalry? Huh? Is that, is that who I think it is? Oh, hell yeah! You guys really came to save me! Ow! Oh, let go! Oh. <laughs> hey! What do you think you're doing? Here we go. He's a talker. Huh? Whoa! Whoa! No! Huh? You're not gonna... Hold up! Wait! Don't... Don't do it, man! You wanna live? Then get the hell out of town. <laughs> you, you got it, boss! You ain't never gonna see my face again! I swear! <laughs> Are you sure about this? It's a big risk. I know, but... It's fine. And them? No more. Cloud, you're scaring me. <clears throat> we need to go before they wake up. I'm worried about Johnny. I'm more worried about us. We gotta go, right? Right. What? It's just... You've really changed. How? I suppose it's... Yeah. Your eyes. They used to be less... It's the Mako. Soldier, remember? I remember. So, what do you want to do now? Head back to the bar, or do you want to tackle another job or two? jurisdiction show some spine uh, yes sir ma'am if you don't leave at once I will be forced to arrest you oh yeah go ahead <sighs> Tifa you won't believe this 
A Cerulean Drake flew in from the train graveyard, but these two clowns refused to get off their butts and do anything about it! Hey, is that... It is you, the new Merc! Then maybe you can help us out! The Drake is in the old Telegraph factory over there, but to reach it, you'll need to get a hold of a watch security key. You should be able to find one inside one of the crates. I forget which, just smash them all. You working? Just like that, okay? I got gotcha. you. Let's end this quick. Not a problem. That's that. No holding for nothing. Was never in doubt. Coming. Go for it! 
Keep those gloves up. Sure thing, coach. And there he is! I knew you were the right man for the job. There's no denying you're the real deal. Not like these idiots with their excuses. Rather have one of you than 20 of them. They're just doing their jobs. Can't expect them to be at your beck and call. What exactly is it you're trying to say, Merc? You need people who can follow orders, too. I see now. Heard you were ex Shinra. Guess I shouldn't be surprised you'd go to bat for your old buddies. Me? I'm just looking out for my people. All there is to it. Hell with you. We can take care of this town ourselves. No more Mercs or Shinra. We'll build up the watch and kick you all out. For you, Merc. You totally saved that man's business. A certain shopkeeper told me you paid him a visit. Thanks for helping him out. Just so happens there's another job I'd like to offer you. Now that I know you can handle yourself in a fight, you've got a real killer on the loose, you see. A rabid catch dog. Maybe you've heard people talking about it. Shinra Mutt gone feral. Last sighting was in Scrap Boulevard. Think you're up to it? I'll handle it. You're a lifesaver. Doubt anyone else around here stands a chance. Go get him, bud. I have to tell you that I'm grateful for all of your help thus far. I've done it. I've developed a new materia. to receiving all of your future battle intel submissions. Get yourself hurt.
coming through. Out of our way. Let's do this. I got your number. through. Out of our way! Took care of the dog, did you? Phew. We owe you one. Gotta say, I've never seen a Shinra breed like that before. Out of curiosity, when exactly did it show up? Oh, today. The first reports came in just this morning. Uh, why do you ask? Wait a minute. There's this crazy story about a Shinra research lab hidden right beneath our feet under the slums. Huh. Really? That's news to me. <laughs> and here I thought you might know something I don't. Well, I guess not. It's a big organization. I'm sure there's lots of secrets I don't know. Yeah, fair enough. You got the bastard. That's good enough for me. Okay then. That's another solid gig in the books. 
You know, the whole town is really impressed with what you've done. Keep it up, and you'll have enough work to keep you fed for a lifetime. Well, thanks to you. And don't you forget it. So where do we get paid? The shop or something? Yeah, but why don't we head back to the apartments first? Take a quick breather. Which lesson was that again? Lesson one. Got it? Anyway, let's go. The watch is saying they're gonna step up their game. Good riddance to those rodents. Huh? Someone's back awful early. Not that I mind. Would you two be dears and swap your filters out for me? I left them in your rooms. Sure thing. Not so fast, you. Do me a favor. She needs a friend. A real friend. We're already friends. So when she talks, are you really listening? Thinking about her and her feelings? Or are you just going through the motions? Go on. Let's take care of this real quick, okay? Sure. Come over when you're done. One sec. I'll be done in a bit. <sighs> Finally. <sighs> so, after you left the village, mm -hmm. I let you off the hook before, back at the hall, but not this time. Well, when we were kids, everybody wanted to be a soldier, right? Yeah, I remember they were on the news every day during the war. Thing is, by the time I finally made it in, they didn't need heroes anymore. It was nothing like what we dreamt of. It was just working for Shinra. Just... I'm sorry. I know it's a touchy subject. Oh. Not exactly small talk. Especially with someone you haven't seen in a while. I get it. Still, it's kind of funny. Us going our separate ways, thinking that must be it. That we'd never meet again. And then here, of all places, we do. You know what? We should totally celebrate. Let's dress up and hit the town. Really? I mean, why not? It'll be fun. Do you even have fancy clothes? Not like fancy fancy, but I'll figure something out. What do you think would suit me, huh? Something exotic? Uh, really? Then again, if we're making an effort... Be sure to pick an outfit that goes with mine, okay? Will do. <laughs> this is gonna be so much fun. You'll see. Yeah. 
Maybe. <laughs> and on that happy note, I think it's time we head back to the bar. Come on. Uh, you don't need a break? Honestly, I'm feeling pretty good. Marl isn't always right, you know. Filters. So we're gonna head back to the bar now. Take care, you two. Oh, you're looking pretty chipper. Uh, I don't feel that different. Must be my imagination then. <laughs> anyway, keep your wits about you, Merc. A token of my appreciation. Be good to her. Keeping your nose to the grindstone, huh? I've got just the thing for a go-getter like you. Same as you, I guess. Could use a little something to take the edge off, right? How about a refreshing cocktail made by yours truly that you can sit back and savor? Tifa. Yeah, I'm feeling it a bit too. Hey, do you think you'll stick around a little longer? <sighs> Maybe. Work for a minute, build up some savings. I see. So, what'll it be? Want to head back out for a little while? Yeah, why not? Well, you want to head inside? We're back. Did you have fun? <laughs> Lots of fun. Hey, need y'all downstairs. Uh, right now? Then the plan is... Marlene, wanna go wait for Jesse out front? Okay. <sighs> <sighs> Looks like we're officially on for tomorrow night then. Gotta go over the details with the others. Before you do, about my pay... You'll get your money. So sit down and shut up until we're finished. Double time, Tifa. Oh, I'm really sorry, but it shouldn't take much longer. In the meantime... <laughs> grab a seat. What'll it be? I don't know. Something hard and bitter. Well, 
Most people would say something sweet right about now. I'm sure they would. Ah, uh, but you're a more discerning customer, aren't you? In which case... Our house special, the Cosmo Canyon. Beautiful. <laughs> I gotta go. <sighs> Enjoy. Her? Hey, you see the news? The reactor bombing was the work of the eco-extremist group Avalanche. Public enemy number one. Gets your heart racing, doesn't it? They don't know our faces, so we're in the clear for now. But we'll want to capitalize on this momentum. Speaking of which, you coming on the next one? For the right price. Oh, you can bet I'll be pushing hard for a raise. <sighs> Tifa will be joining us too, but I don't know. Even a blind man can see her heart's not in it. She was never on board with the bombings, so if it comes down to do or die, if I've got to put my life in someone else's hands, then I'd rather that someone was a professional, like you. Could still kill some time. <laughs>